Yes, there is a lot of competition in the NFL week in, week out with injuries, with a play here, a play there. The Patriots have a target on their back. And the Patriots have not repeated since 3 4 But the New England Patriots are my pick to win the Super Bowl this year. They are the best football team in this league. And what we've learned is they handle expectations as well as anybody. And here is the key. Here's the crux. If there is a secret sauce to the Pat's success, it's that Belichick and Brady provide the perfect tandem in that they never are satisfied. There is no exhale from them. If you look at Joe Montana, I just read his biography over the summer. By the time Montana wins his fourth Super Bowl in 1989, he's exhausted. The winning has gotten a lot. The celebrity's gotten too much. The expectations have worn him down. And when he finally goes to Kansas City in 92 and 93, those are not moments, or 93 and 94, those are not moments where he is really grinding looking to win a Super Bowl. He just wants to finish off his career on a healthy note by playing 16 games. The winning's already been done. Bill Walsh is part of that same dynasty, retires in 1988 after a Super Bowl win. Worn down health-wise, the vigor just wasn't there anymore. Jimmy Johnson bolts after just two Super Bowls. I can't work like this. Vince Lombardi leaves the Packers. Again, the winning had become exhausting, and he had to leave and reset. He had retired, only to come back with Washington a year later and then pass away from cancer. When you talk about these dynasties, Bill Walsh had to walk away. Chuck Noll lost his effectiveness, was no longer drafting the way that he once did in the early 70s. The fact is winning wears you down, except that Belichick and Brady take no days off. And it's a cliche moniker for them, but they don't. They are driven maniacally every single year that it's never enough. It's never enough. It's never enough. It's very much like Michael Jordan. It is never enough, except that Michael Jordan actually retired twice because he was overwhelmed. These guys have this innate ability to never be satisfied. It's never enough and to never allow the celebrity or the pressure or the expectations or the winning to overwhelm them. It's inhuman in a lot of ways because almost everybody else in sports history, especially in a modern time, is exhausted and beaten down and takes a breather every so often. And those guys do not which is why I think they'll repeat this year and win another Super Bowl.